as he got more famous and made bigger films, you people would turn up to, you know, famous actors would turn up. You know, Warren Beatty would turn up, or Meryl Streep would be around, or uh, Christopher Reeve, you know, Superman would suddenly turn up at the door. <laughs> He's the only man I ever met who could tell you what was wrong with the film. Who could look at a film and say, the problem is this. I remember one time when he was filming in, uh, in Mexico for, for Who Stopped the Rain, and he was very, very preoccupied by the, some camera angle or something, and he managed to walk straight into a swimming pool. <laughs> aby Karel nespadl z okna. On pořád chtěl sedět tam a dívat se dolů, aby, se viděl, aby viděl svět. I don't think he felt like he was Czech and I don't think he felt like he was English. I think he wasn't really sure what he was. So it was success before he even to see them. So it was really in the air. No, couldn't go on like that. You want your dinner? Here, why don't you eat it now? You want to play? You want to play? We were very funny together, actually. Uh, a lot of jokes. You thought the scene where Albert Finney goes to bed and then he sees his mother and his sister in the street. Pronikat do světa ženského myšlení pro něj bylo velmi zajímavým tématem. He made some big Hollywood films where he had some sort of quite big budgets. He never made big budget movies. They asked him to do Star Wars, the third, the third film in Star Wars. I would say he always had a broad view, an international view, and he was a, an international first-class master of the cinema. Well, uh, we should have died, no. <laughs>